I'm here at the Powerhouse Museum where there is any favours by drawing against sales that a fantastic day for men here on the red carpet today. with yours faithfully, Chris Burns. And my two movie picks of the week are Fantastic, isn't it? And in case you're wondering where I am, I'm here at the Powerhouse Museum, where there is the most amazing menswear exhibition from the 18th century to the present. And in this exhibition, it's beautiful because it links the history and the fashion, incorporating 130 menswear pieces, which include amazing menswear designers such as Alexander McQueen, Calvin Klein, Burberry, and Giorgio Armani. And it's aptly called reigning men because it really, really challenges that notion of masculinity in male's fashion today. Beginning with the 18th century, the male aristocrat would always wear a beautiful three-piece suit, which was just as lavish and opulent as his female counterpart at the time. Now, dressing those days for men was not about rolling out of bed and putting on whatever. It was a form of pure expressionism, and it was a form and a way to woo the ladies of the time. And who could forget the most amazing period of menswear fashion of all time? I bring to you the mod. The mob was all about the high energy, the colour, the excitement of the Carnaby Street at the time. And to wear this particular type of fashion, you are in a cool social group and it's actually my favourite fashion period of menswear. And who can forget the current 21st century male? And we all know them, who by day loves to wear that skinny sharp suit such as this Izzy Miyake creation behind me and a beautiful floral tuxedo by night such as this Tom Ford creation right in front of us. So why don't you guys do yourself a favour, book a ticket here to the Powerhouse Museum where you will absolutely feast your eyes on 130 current menswear pieces which are on display which is absolutely phenomenal. Now I know this statement will make me a hated target at all the boiler room water coolers, but underperforming salespeople aren't doing themselves any favours by drawing against sales that likely won't happen. Now do everyone a favour and help them seek career development elsewhere. If they aren't making their targets after a few months, the odds of them making perform better are slim, and the money you are spending on their training and overheads is much better spent on the top producers you already have. Use the money you already have to buy your top performers better leads, better marketing support, and better sales tools. And free up their time from paperwork and they'll use it to get more leads. Give them assistance and they'll double their effort. They already know how to sell and they probably like it. Do everything you can to make them happier and more productive. Good morning and welcome to the Shopping Network. And it's a fantastic day for men because today, is Men's Pampering Day. And do not kid yourself, men, because I know out there that you want to look and feel as great as women do each day. And I have got one of the most amazing L'Oreal men's products that I really want you to have a look at. So today, I've got the L'Oreal Men Expert Hydra Energetic Extreme Cleanser Magnetic Charcoal. And when you say charcoal, a lot of people do think, why would you have charcoal in a cleanser? And I'll tell you why, because I know that men are the outdoors type. Men like to get out there, get down and dirty. And this particular product with charcoal will actually eliminate all the excess oils and also the impurities of a man's skin at the end of the day. And it's a great little bargain because today it is only $6.99. Now that is wonderful for a L'Oreal Men Expert product. And if you call in the next 15 minutes, what we'll do is we'll throw in the L'Oreal Men Expert Hydra Energetic All-in-One Moisturizer because I know men out there that you want to moisturize day and night, and this one is fundamental to use with your cleanser. So a moisturizer that is light on the skin, your mates will never know that you're actually wearing it, so to speak, but um, what I'd like you to do is call in the next 15 minutes and we'll give you the moisturizer plus the charcoal. Hello and welcome to Movie Night here on the red carpet with yours faithfully, Chris Burns. And my two movie picks of the week are definitely not what you would call the norm. Starting with Beast, starring Jesse Buckley and Johnny Flynn, who burn off the screen in this jittery, surprising psychodrama. This impressive debut by writer-director Michael Pierce emanates a chill that will have you hugging your sides. And just when you think you've got it pinned down, hair pins off in a new direction. And I loved it, and I gave it a four out of five stars. And my second choice of the evening is Tully. And who does not love an emotional comedy? It's starring the beautiful Charlize Theron, and she shines in a funny, honest, and occasionally excruciating love letter to motherhood. 
Marlow, as she's called, is a heavily pregnant suburbanite who seems completely trapped out by her two preteen children. A comedy about nothing less than the proper way to say goodbye to the past. You would have to be in the mood to see this movie. I've given it a three out of five. Looking forward to picking two more highly acclaimed movies for you next week. Till then, enjoy your night at the movies.